Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, Alright, today we'll do an unboxing video of the Sontronics Mercury. Alright, it's a really cool mic. So let's get to it. All right. Comes in a big brown box and inside we have this big metal case. Okay. Really keeps the mic secure. To be honest, I haven't seen this yet, so it's going to be a real unboxing video for once. Ooh, all right. Can you see that? We've got a quick start guide over here. Just some brochures of their different mics that, we ha uh, that they have. A really huge shock mount really big some extra elastics your XLR cable and power adapter for the amp it's really big okay now the microphone itself is in this really cool really vintage looking wooden box Ooh. thing about con condenser mics is that they're very delicate so you have to be really careful handling them All right it is a multi uh, pattern mic and you can switch between different patterns in the amp itself over there okay you've got a figure eight cardioid and omnidirectional over here your mic goes there and then this one connects to your I don't know your mixer or your sound card or anything or your preamp and that's your power button. I mean, that's pretty much straightforward. Okay, now next, um, we are going to do the testing of the microphone, all right? My boy Omar, who is behind the camera right now, will help with that. Let's go. Hey guys, okay, so this is the microphone test of the Sontronics Mercury. Forgive the slight background noise. The settings, I mean, I haven't put any kind of tweaks uh, on the mixer or on the preamp. Uh, this is the settings right now, minus 10 dB pad off and the high pass uh, filter is off as well. On the mixer, I have the gain knob all the way up to one o'clock, up fader all the way up and that's pretty much it. It's passing through, the mic is passing through the preamp obviously and the preamp is passing through the PreSonus Studio Live AR12 USB. And what I'm recording on right now is the PreSonus uh, Studio One 3. So that's the that's the um, clean settings basically. I'm gonna turn on the minus 10 dB pad. So this is this is the recording with the minus 10 dB pad uh, turned on. Turn it back off. And uh, I, right now I'm going to turn on the high pass filter. So this is the high pass filter turned on. As you can hear, check one, two, three. Low frequencies, uh, you know, it's there, but it's not as prominent as uh, it is a while ago. I'm gonna turn it off again. So this is the high pass frequency turned off, uh, sorry, high pass filter turned off. Now I'm gonna turn on both the minus 10 dB pad and the high pass filter on again, all right? So this is with both the minus 10 dB pad on and the high pass filter on as well. I should tell you that this is uh, recorded in the cardioid pattern. Okay, now both of them are turned off again. I'm going to switch to, right now this is in cardioid, I'm going to switch to Omni. It's going to be a little bit more noisy, but bear with me. Now this is turned to omnidirectional pattern 
uh, as you can make out from the background noise, uh, the microphone picks up from 360 degrees all around. I'm going to now turn it to the figure eight. That's cardioid again. And now it's in the figure eight. So the figure eight is, it picks up both from the front and the back, but not on the sides. So that's a figure eight for you. I'm turning it back to cardioid. So that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, uh, leave them down at the comments. Um, I hope you, I hope this video was uh, informative. See you guys next time. All right. Cheers.